each one. So here is a list made up with the help of the Washington Post. And even we couldn't even fit all the lies in one graphic. Trump claimed nobody was charged for deaths in the Black Lives Matter protests. Not true. He said he saved historically black colleges and universities. Not true. He said he is the best president for black Americans since Abraham Lincoln. Really? There, there is an invasion of 15, 16, 7 million people coming across the border. Absolutely not true. That Harris, Kamala Harris, has the, has, was the border czar. She is not. Many migrants are coming from mental institutions, he says. They are not. The crime rate of other countries is going down. It is not. The U.S. is having its worst inflation in 100 years. Not true. Biden was ruled incompetent in his presidential records case. He was not. Democrats allowed the killing of babies after being born. Come on now, are you for real? And there's more that everyone wanted Roe v. Wade overturned. It is, in fact, exactly the opposite. Drilling will reduce inflation. How so? Grocery bills are up 60%. Simply not true. The U.S. has more oil than any other country. Based on what data? And last but not least, falsely suggesting that maybe Kamala Harris had decided to turn black. My God, as, as a reporter, how do you even start with covering this man?